So hey y'all, I made a modification to my chin strap that I bought for my ResMed nasal mask. Uh, my problem was is that my uh, mouth apparently was coming open during the night and drying out completely. And I was scared, really scared about my teeth getting decay and I didn't want that to happen of course. So I ordered, <clears throat> I should have showed you this before I did something to it, but I ordered this chin strap <clears throat> from ResMed. It's actually a ResMed chin strap. And the idea was it was supposed to go under the mask uh, headgear, sort of, and, and hook to itself, which I'll try to show you. i holding the camera here. Um, but... It was supposed to go up around your head and then hook together like so. Well, the problem is if you have hair, it will uh, slip during the night on your hair and then you're back to the same exact same problem. So, <clears throat> what I did was I held it together like this oops and like that okay and I cut off this excess so this side right here there, was like that and so I cut that off and it didn't have this black part I cut that off and then this is the side that I used to hook to that part I cut that off, part of it off, so that I had the hook part of the Velcro, uh, this piece here, and I sewed it onto this other side where I'd cut the longer piece off. Because my reasoning is, or was, that because the headgear for the ResMed nasal mask is made of the exact type of material as the chin strap it's like the um loop part i guess anyway velcro hook sticks right to it so my idea was put on the head mask then take your chin strap and put it on and then take it around and get it to fit you of course as tight as you want it and it hook on the other side of the head gear that way it's not on your hair it can't move and it will stay so i haven't tried this out yet if it does not work i will re i will let you know but i think it will work awesome and i'm really excited that i went ahead and did this when you're sewing it you can sew it by a machine of course i didn't want to drag out the machine so i just did it by hand um, it's a little tough getting through the uh, chin strap material itself and this Velcro hook stuff. Um, so I suggest if you have a thimble <laughs> to wear it to push through because I actually poked the opposite end of the needle <laughs> uh, into my finger. And the th thimbles that I have are were my great-grandmother's <laughs> and they're way too small for my big hands. But... Anyway, that's just, just a suggestion. Um, anyway, I think this will work great, and I hope it helps somebody out out there that is a CPAP user. Uh, I wear a CPAP because I had a fib, and uh, I actually love the CPAP. All right, that's it. Bye.